a phone number over here. It's uh, 617-206-1050. And uh, give us a call if you got some activist uh, activismisms going on. Let us know about them. And, uh, we're going to talk about gonna, something. Yeah, we really. are going to talk about a little something. To the show in the local... Uh, not in marijuana this time. We're going to get it back into marijuana. But uh, this one's about uh, Cameron D'Ambrosio. Ambrosio. D'Ambrosio. Yeah. And Cammy D. Cammy D. Well, we've been hyping for a long time, his music career. That's right. His song. We've played his song more than anyone else. Out Probably there. On, on air, yeah. Our show. We're pushing Cammy D. We are. We are. He starts to get a nice little tight flow at the end there. He, he, he uh, He's working. Yeah, we're supporting. We want to work with him. We're trying to get him in the studio. We might soon. Yeah. But there's uh, been news. You know, he's obviously been released, and uh, we're all going to show up in June, at the end of June here on a Thursday to uh, Lawrence Courtroom to uh, try to get those charges fully redu- reduced and have a big celebration in the parking lot after outside the courthouse and uh there's a big what's going on now frank do you know this about this yeah absolutely man we we have a uh an event coming up on july 6th at the um the name of the place is the the crown the crown the that's crown. right that's right the crown and that's in lowell mass um so you can google that it's uh the crown uh, let's see uh, seven, 74 middlesex street in lowell, lowell. Yeah, Massachusetts, Lowell. and uh, that's going to be popping off. There's a Facebook page that you can uh, that you can join up on. Yeah, and there's a lot of good artists playing. Uh, Leaders Led, yeah, is playing. I also know uh, Clip from uh, the ST Crew, which is uh, Terminology's crew. He's been on the Freedom Rally stage several times and done some video. I've hung out with him and smoked some flavors with him. He's coming down to perform. I know that. Very nice, very nice. Yeah. And who else? And you know? we uh, we got uh, Revolution is Evolution uh, Chance coming out. And uh, he's gonna, he's going to perform and yeah. rock a set. Uh, Cammy's going to be there, um, you know, with his family, and uh, you'll get a chance to uh, to meet them and and uh, talk to a uh, political prisoner, you know, right? Yeah, <laughs> it, live in the flesh. And it's a former Crown Movie Theater building. It's now a club. It's a freedom of speech benefit for Cam De- DeBrosio and family. And all proceeds are going to benefit Cameron. You can find about it on Facebook. Revolution is Evolution presents. It's going to be a huge event. It's uh, July 6th, Saturday night at the Crown, 74 Middlesex Street, Lowell, Mass. If you want more info, 978-323-9609. There's also a Facebook.com uh, slash the Crown Lowell if you want to find out more information about the venue. And uh, it is 21 plus. Please bring your ID. And uh, like we said, it's a fundraiser for Cam so that uh, he can be reimbursed for some of this cost. That's right, because they did have a public defender that they did have to, uh, you know, they owe some money to. And uh, as always with court, there's court costs, you know. Yeah. And uh, even if they set you free, they still get something out of your pockets on the way out. Yeah. So, uh, And there, there could be some special uh, surprises. We don't know what's going to happen. There's been a lot of talk, and uh, I wonder... If there won't be some speeches, too, and who might actually speak. I would love to speak if they want me, if I can get up there. And I'm sure the same Frank would uh, in the King of Paul. I think any of us would love yeah, to Yeah, no, speak. absolutely. And and seriously, like they there, us. there is a 62.9% chance that there is going to be someone there that you wouldn't want to miss if you knew they were going to be there. So you never know on this cause because people are paying attention. They're, yeah. You know, this is about uh, music and musicians and uh just rights, you know, if, if, if some asshole doesn't like you, can they call the police and have you taken away for something you say? Like, Mr. Rob Kaufman, you could, uh, th- I mean, you're here running our board today, you're not much, I wouldn't say you would uh, want to be called an activist, but your freedom of speech, you, you put out some stuff that people don't like. Do you I ever do. get worried that uh, police might come to your house because some, someone's a bitch? No, not at all. I get more worried that uh, somebody's gonna, some special interest group is gonna cause some kind of an issue because I said a slur or something. Yeah, on, like and try to get your show canceled. Type. Yeah, yep. I'm I mean, like, that's a you're that's perpetuating all- the rape culture. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's always a concern, isn't it? I mean, yeah. for all of us, whether we address it or not. I mean, even ourselves. Well, well yeah, we- you know, especially um, when being activists or just being people who don't give a shit what people think about what we say. Um, we have to deal with the backlash that comes along with that. And, uh, you know, no one's going to come in and, and lock us up, but they thought they could take advantage of this young kid and was, uh, bring him through yeah, the system. You know, because he was he, a young kid. Yeah, and he had a little bit of a, of a record, you know. And, and so, he had a little bit of a beef at the high school. Yeah, and, and like, so now they, they thought, you know, oh, well, the state's going to get one on this dude and we're going to set a precedent. And yeah. uh, He's got you know, no friends. 
But it turned out he had a lot of friends. That's right. He had a lot That's of right. friends. That's right. You know, and, and we Still filled does. that courtroom for him, um, you know, at his last court date. And uh, I think the prosecution really took notice of that, you know, and, and uh, definitely saw, you know, with us, you know, with the King of Pot being out there. And Garrett and the, Kirkland. The King of Pot, you know, we're, we're doing his, uh, the video, the awesome video that he yeah, made. Yeah, he did a killer video. Um, that was unbelievable. You know, and we was, did that right in, front, in the front door of the courthouse, you know. Yeah. And uh, let our presence be known. You yeah, know? that video and, was uh, really strong. The speeches, the people who spoke in that, uh, the pirates were there. Lucia was there. Yeah, that's I right. I mean, there's so many different. Uh, the ACLU, Whitney Taylor was even there. The woman that uh, got decrim passed and medical marijuana and passed with the ACLU was there to witness it, uh, to be a legal observer. Uh, there were there were people uh, like I said, Garrett Kirkland organized quite a bit. Frank, you were there. Yeah, no, Garrett organized that, that pretty much that whole deal, you know, Chance. got folks out there, Chance, you know, he got um, KOP to come out, I mean, he did a great job with it, you know, and uh, we all were there, and we all took part Evan in it, and we all, too, yeah. yep, Evan also was awesome. uh, from, uh, uh, what is it, uh, the, f- um, we defend our, the, yeah. is it Fight for the Future, um, for so the future. Evan from uh, Fight for the Future, and um, they had a uh, another one called. Uh, at any rate, now digital Fourth Amendment rights were out there. Yep. You know, um, so we had the Pirate Party with the digital Fourth Amendment rights. We had defend the Fourth in the House. We had you know at revolution evolution. We had you know marijuana wraps. You, you know, know they, a ACLU. lot of people too. This is the point too about marijuana. I want to. I think I'm going to try to get into this more uh, through even the station. Even Rob Kaufman kind of talking about doing something in the future in the day, but. It's, again, a point that uh, it's not just about really about smoking weed and marijuana. Like, the marijuana group, the marijuana reformers were really interested in this one, and it wasn't about weed at all. It was about free speech. You know, the marijuana community, Rich Fu was there. Yeah. The king of pot. That's right. Myself, I was involved. And when I said Whitney Taylor, I mean, that's a good representation. And there was so much support from the community there, too. Absolutely. And it just, you know, shows the kind of network that we have here in Massachusetts as <clears throat> excuse me, as activists, and, you know, it can it can turn on at the flip of a switch, you know, at the clank of a jail cell. We can, you know, be there and be ready to uh, stand up for what's right and uh, defend individuals or the group from, you know, the, the government, from the machine, and, uh, you know, remind them that we're there, we have rights, we know we have rights, and they're not going to be taken away from us, you know. Uh, so, you know, if you want to check this out, you can check us out there. I'll be there on Saturday, July 6th at the Crown in Lowell on middle, uh, 74 Middlesex Street, you know. Um, is there a time on there when that's getting started, dude? I'm not sure, but I imagine it's probably 8, 9 p.m. I didn't see the latest. Uh, it's not on this flyer that we're looking at, but it could be on one of the... The other flyers, but it's it's going to be a, a nighttime event, and you should just check it out on Facebook and check out the videos from the King of Pot too, because uh, like we said, that's on Mike Can uh, YouTube slash YouTube dot com slash Mike Can, as well as uh, KLP Productions. You can find the video that the King of Pot did, and it's friggin' awesome from that. Of you know from that. Yeah, no, uh, it's great, and he's going to have another one coming out too um, in the next you know com- the coming uh, you know weeks, two weeks or so. And uh, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be a little. It's going to be like the director's cut, basically, of the uh, of the video that he made the last time. So it's going to be fresh. And uh, yeah, come on out and make sure you remember that there's a there's a super secret special guest um, that yeah, may be attending that um, that event there. So you know, check if us out. If it happens, thank us. And if it doesn't, uh, we didn't say anything. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, with the two hot hats, where activism happens, you can call in at 617-206-1050. And uh, we're talking about Revolution is Evolution, an event they're doing Saturday, July 6th at the Crown. And it's for free Cammy D to raise money for uh, this kid that was 18 years old that said some things on Facebook that ended up getting him thrown in jail and then later released with a grand jury would not indict him because he didn't break any crimes and he was held in jail for over a month and there's a lot of cost and uh, financial strain on his family related to this so we're going to raise money some of the acts playing again one more time is Chance is playing Clip is playing uh, Kadiak it's K-A-H-D-I-A yeah, that, you said that right yeah. D-I-A-K Kadiak Riggs Leaders led 97, 978 Fam, Pounds, Mr. They, Sun B, Evan Greer is going to perform, and Matt Gainham, the poet. And uh, like we said, there's going to be some special guests. You never know who else might be there. It's going to be a fun night. Sure is. That's right. And uh, we're the two hotheads, and we'll be back. Oh, yeah. 